In Genesis chapter 4, we witness the first birth of mankind. In verse 1 we're told, Now Adam knew his wife Eve, and she conceived and bore Cain, and said, I have acquired a man from the Lord. Then she bore again, and this time his brother Abel. And all seemed right in the world. But just as sin entered the world through Adam, we now see it continue through the offspring of Adam and Eve. As the two brothers matured, Adam became a shepherd while Cain cultivated the ground. And at harvest time, Cain brought some of his crops as a gift to the Lord. And likewise, Abel brought a gift. He brought the best portions of the firstborn lambs from his flock. And this is where the story gets interesting. We're told that the Lord accepted Abel and his gift, but rejected Cain and his gift. Why did God accept one and reject the other? Well, in the New Testament, the writer of Hebrews clearly explained why Abel's offering was accepted and Cain's offering rejected. Hebrews 11.4 says this, It was by faith that Abel brought a more acceptable offering to God than Cain did. Abel's offering gave evidence that he was a righteous man, and God showed his approval for his gifts. Although Abel is long dead, he still speaks to us by his example of faith. God desires our best, and that's what Abel offered. Cain offered some of the fruits of the soil to God, while Abel offered fat portions, some of the firstborn of his flock. Cain chose some of his, Abel chose the best of his. As we read Genesis 4 today, let's remember together that God desires our best, as he should, but he also has his best in store for you and I.